She is very good, Christian, as you would expect from somebody who won 13 of their first 14 feature races, won over 30 races overall. Before we show you us on the track, I want to show you this. This is a little back pad and a side pad. I know you understand this as a motorcycle guy because the G-forces that you take when you turn these corners, you get over two Gs. It's one of the only uh, racing machines where you get that many Gs because you're so low to the ground and you're making such tight turns. So this is one key piece of equipment. This didn't really help me. I don't think there was a whole lot that would have helped me when I got on the track against Sierra earlier. Take a look. It feels tight, it feels awkward. I'm sure it'll feel the same way when we get out onto the track, Once too. You're... You always want to stay closest to the grass. Okay. You don't want to come over here because you can't run over Ravana. Okay. You don't want to do that at all. Yeah. See that 89 there? That's all I'm going to be following the entire time because I'm never going to get past that. Yeah. Um, kind of got to do like an S and then like you go over there and then to over here. Okay. Basically, you're trying to make it the shortest path. Well, if you stay over there, you're not going to do that turn, right? I mean, it's not going to work very well. You're going to go off in the grass. So it's pretty intense out there, especially at the start. Well, a lot of them are rookies, and they are usually towards the back. Well, you were a rookie just like two years ago. Yeah, right? two years ago. <laughs> Do I have any chance against you when I get in that cart? I don't think you will. <laughs> As you would for my wife. But no. Well, you saw us on the track there. As she said, I really didn't have much of a chance. I think that was pretty evident before we got into the carts. This is Chuck. He owns this place, Ravenna Motor Park. You say, I just got out in the track a little bit uh, in between segments there. I did better the second time than much I did the better, first time, much right? Better, much better the second time, Tim. Uh, we got down within about three seconds a lap of what, what our normal competitors would run out here. The key is trusting in the vehicle that it is going to turn, and most of these people who are out there who do this for uh, on a regular Regular basis, they don't use brakes at all. Very, very minimal braking. It is, it is all a momentum game in racing. We try to tell people you got to keep your speed up through the corners uh, to carry any kind of speed down the straightaways. It is a momentum game. Very little brakes. We just want you know this is what we work with in our program for the kids out here. We get them out. We turn as many laps as we can, trying to work on carrying that momentum because in the long run it pays big dividends. No matter what type of racing you move into, it's all corner speed. I remember Mark Martin, guys like that. There are so many of the major NASCAR guys who started in karting. Yes, uh, and in fact, a little known fact, Lake Speed was one of the only Americans that has ever won an, uh, a world championship yeah. over in Europe. So, you know, karting's kind of a hidden sport, but it's one of those things that people do progress up through the ranks. It's an excellent starting starting point to get somebody involved in motorsports. And Christian, I know you'll understand this. Once you start, you will not want to stop. I was out there on the track and they were waving frantically for me to come in to talk to you guys again. So it is an absolute hoot. And thanks to Mike. I mean, look at this cart that they painted up for us. It is fantastic. We're going to be bringing the side panels home with us when we come back tonight. Nice job out there. You know, an inexpensive way to hit the track, get the speed, and really enjoy it. It looks like a blast out there. But much like anything that has a lot of speed involved, Christian, it is addicting. Once you start, you are not going to want to stop. Yeah, anything that you have to wear a neck brace at the track, 